Sure. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? You have come from the Jedi Council. Master Matali wishes to speak with you. I will inform him that you are here. Remain at this location until he arrives. My protocol droid tells me you are here on behalf of the Council. I was beginning to think my demands had been ignored, though I think your time would be better spent interrogating the Sandrals as to the whereabouts of my son Shen. Many years ago, I brought my family here to Dantooine to escape the crush of humanity on the Core Worlds. Soon after we settled here, the Sandrals arrived and they have been a plague upon my house ever since. Somehow I imagine the story from the Sandrals would sound just about the same, don't you? The injustices the Sandrals have committed against the Matales are far too numerous to name. But the Council is well aware of our many disputes. Recently I discovered several Sandral droids trespassing on my land. My own security droids destroyed the invaders. Not a single one survived. I have no idea what nefarious purpose lay behind their arrival. My own assassination, perhaps? Destruction of my property? Maybe a simple spy mission? I wasn't about to find out. It was shortly after this incident that Shen, my only son and heir to the Metali estate, vanished. Obviously, Nurik, the unscrupulous head of the Sandral clan, has abducted my son in retaliation for the destruction of his droids. The only resolution possible is the immediate return of my son. Why does the Council insist on stalling? The life of my son is at stake. Is it possible... Yes, of course. Now I understand. I am a man of the world, Jedi. I know how things are done. I will make a contribution of a thousand credits to the Council in exchange for rescuing Shen from the Sandrals. I will present the credits directly to you, of course. Whether the Council ever learns of this donation is completely up to you. Nevertheless, my offer still stands. A thousand credits for Shen's safe return. Know, however, that I will not sit idly by much longer. Eventually, I will take whatever action is necessary to rescue my son, including raising the entire Sandral estate. You would be willing to risk open war over this? It is the Sandrals who have started this, not I. And here I thought you would blame us if we failed. It seems everyone is responsible for your actions, except for you. I don't need to stand here and listen to such impertinence. I'm impressed, Carl. That interjection was very Jedi-like. What can I say? You pick up a few things. I'm afraid Alan is not just making idle threats. He is rash and foolish enough to attempt a full assault on the Sandral estate. Such action would result in an all-out war between the families. I've seen men like Alan Matali before. He's so convinced that his hatred is justified, he's prepared to do anything. And if we don't intervene, there will be war. Until you find Shen, Jedi, we have nothing further to discuss. I suggest you hurry south to their estate, lest I take matters into my own hands. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Cassius is dead, and it is as we feared. You should speak to Murek yourself. He will want to question you on the details of his son's death. Murek left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Murek will meet with you there. I have been informed by my protocol droid that you have news about my son, Cassus. Cassus is dead. I was afraid of this. Yet in my heart I knew it must be true. What... what happened to my son? Cathounds? I, I was so certain the Matali family was to blame. 
But this changes nothing. My own son is dead. Why should I shed one tear about the disappearance of my bitter enemy's son? Typical. Anything to continue the feud which has become so customary to you people. I must ask you something, though it is difficult for me. My son had a diary, his private personal thoughts. Now that he is gone, I have nothing else to remember him by. Please, the diary means more to me than it ever could to you. I will give you a hundred credits for its return. I thank you for this. The diary is all I have left of my son. We have nothing further to discuss. Please, leave me to my grief. You are here from the Council, are you not? Looking for Shen Metale? My name is Raheja. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He is not thinking rationally. My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. You must understand that Father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. My father has kidnapped Shen Matale. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Matales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. I see. Well, there is the answer we seek. The Jedi Council should be informed of this at once. You don't think that perhaps there's more to look at here, do you? That maybe everything isn't what it appears? Of course not. It seems very simple to me. The Council must be allowed to decide the next step. No. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He might hurt him if you do that. He no longer even cares if the Matales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. I am afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. Shen is an innocent victim in all this. My father is not a bad man, but his grief has driven him to madness. He must be stopped. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. 